Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. And I love you guys so much. Again, I cannot thank you guys for the continuous support on the channel. You guys have been absolutely killing it. And I also want to just give a huge shout out to all these companies right here. So New Word's also helping out with the shop. I haven't really set up their things just yet. I promise to give them a shout out down the road. That's what I promised them. But I'm just super stoked for what they've given us. They gave us a heater for the garage. It's getting already cold in the garage. So this is going to help out a lot. And they also gave us a fridge. Like a fridge. Like I don't have a fridge at the garage. That's pretty awesome. Shout out to them. I'm going to go ahead and set this up and show you guys the quality and all that stuff down the road. But check out this massive box right there. That box is from Keys Motorsports. So super stoked on that. Unfortunately, I can't get any of these boxes other than the heater to the garage today. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take the heater with me. Everything else, I'm gonna have to bring the X5 to get it. Thank goodness we have the X5 because uh, it's coming handy. I'm not gonna lie. But anyways, go ahead, take the heater. Ugh, let's go on our journey. Let's head over to the garage. You got a couple things you gotta do. It was actually 50 bucks, not bad. Let's go ahead down to the shop for a full tank. It's actually not bad at all. Let's head down to the shop right now. It's a vlog without uh, some Subway. So I'm gonna get some Subway real quick and I'll catch you guys back at the shop. All right guys, I'm so fat, but it was really good. I love Subway. Um, anyways, we're gonna go get the 435 in here, start doing some mods to it. Again, shout out to Keys Motorsports for always supporting the channel, always hooking it up. But yeah guys, let's go ahead, get my car in here, do some mods to it, make it look 10 times better as usual, and then go ahead and fix that stupid dent. Hopefully we can fix that as well. Let's actually go with the dent first so we can try to have some good news and then go ahead and do the interior because the interior is going to be sick. But anyway, let's get the car in here and do that and then we're going to be working on my brother's car later. So got to do a few things to my brother's car to make it perfect. This car hasn't had a wash in about four days. Let's go ahead and move it back here and give it its traditional wash. All right, guys, so I don't know if you guys can see, like, right here, the camera's a little bit blurry. Um, I just dropped my camera and broke it, so it might be a little bit blurry in this little section down here. I hope you guys... Yeah, my face is a little bit blurry down there. Dang, that sucks. Uh, I try to look into that, see if I can fix it. I don't know if you guys can see all the pieces here. These are all the pieces to the camera that completely broke off. So yeah, these are all the pieces. If I go over here to this angle, like right here on the camera, right here, you guys can see it gets blurry. So uh, I don't know why. The camera looks fine. It's, I mean, it's completely taken apart, but it looks fine. It, it's messed up. Anyways, at least it's usable. Let's just go ahead and just finish up cleaning up this car. I'm hoping what all these pieces that, yeah, you guys can see it's kind of blurry. Dang, that sucks. Anyways, we'll figure that out hopefully tonight. Meantime, let's go ahead and just finish up cleaning the car and we can get to the mods real quick. All right, guys, now that I got the car all cleaned up, let me go ahead and just dry it up. We should be good to go. So this is a little thing from Keys Motorsports. I should probably, I should probably cover this up. Um, it even says fragile. You guys can see I'm clearly caring a lot about this. But inside this box are some major goodies. I, I told you guys I'm gonna go ahead and try to fix this dent first, but I'm, I'm too excited to go ahead and see what's in that box. Let's go ahead and crack the thing open and show you guys. Too excited. Let's go ahead and set it up. I'm gonna get my brother to hold the camera for you guys. He has to see me place it down. First piece of carbon is the dash one, which is the best one in my opinion. Oh, that sits so well. Dude, the fitment is superb. Wow, this is actually looking so good. Like, if, the thing, if you never came in here before the car, like, if you guys just came here for the first time and never seen the wood, you wouldn't even know there was wood behind. It looks super good. Anyways, go ahead and start putting the rest of the carbon goodies. I'm going to put this one right here. Second major carbon goodie. Oh, that looks so good. <laughs> guys, this looks so good. All right, let's go ahead and do the rest of the parts. Dang, that fitment, though, is just really nice. So this side was giving me a little bit more of a hard time because it's a lot, a lot more curvature, a lot more angles. So all this thing you really needed was some heat. We're good to go. Look at that. that. Looks good, doesn't it? Looks super good, man. Damn. Yeah, so that looks really good. This is finally in there. I, dude, this looks really good. This is fancy. I just love how this is all carbon. Eventually, we have to get some carbon goodies here. But honestly, the, the I like how the chrome. You see, like now you can actually see the chrome popping out. You know, like all these little guys. It's like a little bit of silver yeah. with the carbon. I think it looks really sick. So still gotta do the door handle. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. All right, guys, this door handle is on. Oh my lord! I already broke this camera, so I'm gonna use my other one to show you guys some photos. But that looks sick. Feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall 
But tonight I'm letting it go Spend my coin for sure I'm gonna be myself Or I could be someone else No one's stopping me now I'm gonna skip my breaks Alright guys, let's go ahead and see if we can pop this den out. I don't really think we can pop it out too much, but let's just see what we can do here. Let's see if we can pop some magic. So here's some befores. Look at that. Looks looks pretty bad, ain't gonna lie. But uh, we'll show you guys some afters. For a clean title, this is pretty nice. Other than the dent there, the rear bumper and the front bumper, shit like that. You know, things happen in life. But the fact that it's missing a lug nut right there, and the rear one's missing one too, and the rear one on the other side is missing one too, This the, that one's fine, but... How are they missing one lug nut per wheel? That's, I'm gonna have to place an order on some lug nuts there. That's, that's kind of trippy, I ain't gonna lie. Anyways, go ahead and jack up the car and get to work. Um, what's your YouTube channel? Uh, Real Life Exotic. Real Life Exotic. So, um, I've actually met him before. He's one of the people I bought some, uh, E46, E46 things from, and his brother's got a shop over here, and he just came out of nowhere, and I guess I'm going on a test drive, so <laughs> let's just go ahead and go on a yeah, test drive. Let's test it out, yeah. bro. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here, let's but. see what it's got. I swear to God, if I die, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll have a video, bro. <laughs> no, we'll, we'll do it good, bro, not All right. too much. Hold up. I'm trying to get married, I'm trying to have kids one day, bro. Yeah, when? Soon? <laughs> so not Yo, soon, how, how old are you? I'm, uh, I'm 21. 21? I'm, I'm just trying to have kids one day. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Yeah, bro, just birds. How much, yeah. how much horsepower does this thing have? I don't know. You don't know? I bought a second gear. Second gear, just pressing it. Bro, chill! Oh my ready? god. What do you mean? I thought we are done. <laughs> oh shit! Oh my god. No, are these tires bald or what? No, I, I had them uh, put in like a month ago. These are Michelin's. brand new tires? Michelin's, yeah. But they're getting bald already. <laughs> no shit. Oh my god! You gotta do a video from outside. You can't really see inside like yeah, you, you're, you guys. Re oh my god! I have to come during the day, bro. Yeah, Swing by again. We gotta do it, dude. You guys, I swear, I came out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude, this is insane. Bro, this car is here, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, he's f***ing crazy! <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, up, I, I gotta get out of here. I don't know this man. <laughs> I don't know this man. So this is how it looks. It does look better. Um, show you guys how it looks. Yeah, but it, it's still disgusting as shit. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and do is take it out of the body shop and get this thing fixed. I really didn't want to do it at the body shop because then I'll have Bondo and I really didn't want to deal with that. But the way the dent was, there was no way around it. It's not like you just do paintless dent removal. The, the dent had like a, pretty much a sharp end to it. So it looked like it, 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 it's messed up. So. We tried our best, at least it's a little bit more presentable now. But that's all we can do now, so throw on the wheel for now. Go ahead and call a couple body shops, see the best quote for it, and see what shop can probably do with the least amount of Bondo, because I don't want much Bondo on this quarter panel. It is a clean title, so I want it like as little as possible to where I can just cut it off when we, if I ever do plan on doing a wide body or something like that, which I do want to do one day. All right, guys. So the wheels pretty much get to go now. My brother's just going ahead, doing a few things, buttoning up his uh, his E90, just doing a little bit of uh, a little bit, a little bit of work there. And then uh, grills already came in. We have some air scoops at home. We'll do that later in a separate video. Um, the clips are also coming in, so we'll go ahead and put that back together later. Pretty much all this is standing up from this door being shut, so we're not opening up the rear doors. Um, as of now, the only other thing that's wrong with this car interior wise, uh, we went ahead and replaced this door speaker, we replaced this shifter, it's just this ignition switch. Let me show you guys what's going on with that. So when you put the key in here, see how it goes in and out? 
it shouldn't be able to like, go in and out. Like while you're driving, let me sh turn on the car for y'all. Like car is on, you can take the key out. Like, and it keeps throwing random errors when you're doing that. So Arlon, a friend of ours that you guys saw a long time ago, for those of you guys who are new, really good friend of mine, he moved down to Texas. Uh, he went ahead and sold, uh, sent, us, sent us out one of these bad boys. I have his channel linked down below if you guys want to check him out. So shout out, shout out to him for this. So this is a new ignition. So let's just go ahead and just swap it out and hopefully no coding necessary. Hopefully this should just work. I don't know if you guys can see that top clip like um, right here. That clip is there. See it's clearly broken off right there. So I think that's the problem. Ignition's in, old ignition is out. Let's go ahead and see if the key will come out. So key's in the car, start up the car. See if it'll come out. Nope, finally. Now that my brother's car is finally buttoned up and this camera is finally broken, <laughs> let's go home. Let's go ahead and head home. I'm um, gonna call it an early day today. I think it's only like 6.30. It is super dark out, so it looks like it's been like 10 p.m. for the longest time. But no, we're gonna go home, I'm gonna get something to eat. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and chill for a little bit and then go ahead, edit the video, and then head to the gym later tonight. So without further ado, guys, if you guys are excited for what's going on with the 435, I already ordered some new wheels, some new suspensions coming in the mail. So those are things that I, you guys are not ready for. Wide body is something I want to do on the 435, but if you guys can actually link a decent wide body down below, I haven't found any nice ones. And this is one on eBay that I just don't like don't mind my hair but yeah if you guys do find one let me know link it down below without further ado guys i'll catch you on the next one so i love y'all so much remember to stay humble and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out yeah yeah let's go i ain't the first with the curse with the thirst that i want to be better not worse man it hurts i'm on this earth with my words and i put them all together in cert because i want to have worth